Greetings, this is Simple and the Brain. And today we're going to find you a very good fire hack with a piece of bark from a tree. But first, let's go and find some. And now we can see some lovely silver birch. Look at this stuff. This is what you want. This is silver birch. But the simple fact is, I know where there's a much, much better. And here is the silver birch. Luckily I have permission from an anonymous owner. Thank you very much. And now I shall show you the technique to cut this piece of bark with a knife appropriately. And using one hand I score appropriately with the blade and across the top here as well. And just down the bottom too, give it a little score there just for safety measures. And now we strip her back and just sort of like Peel it back and sort of, as you can see, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. And you know, you can just keep on going. So I might as well take a little bit more, eh? Well, there we go. And I think that this will probably be enough. It is raining, by the way, so that's exciting. Incidentally, what has four eyes but cannot see is Mississippi. Awesome. And now we gather a few twigs. I snapped these off the tree behind me, so I think they're still alive. And now we get a small piece of silver bark. Let's try this bit here, it looks pretty good. Now it is raining a bit and it's getting dark, but this stuff's brilliant for that. Now watch this as I get it a bit wet. Here we go. You have to admit that I've got that wet now. Now we'll pop it into the fire here, here we go. And uh, we pop that in there like that. And now what we do is we get our sticks. We put them on there like that. Just, just cram them on. And now, now we get our lighter. Hang on, let me just find it in my pocket. Here we go, it could be one match. Now this is wet. Let's just give it a go. Come on, baby. Come on, baby, light my fire. Bearing in mind, this is wet. You just saw that, it's a continuous shot. Mm -mm, amen. That's going pretty well for something that's just been sprayed with a hose. So, there you go. Thank you very much for having me indeed. Now, I know it's getting dark, but please try to think of this one. What travels around the world, but stays in one space? Well, I'll tell you the next time. Thank you. And until the next time, be good.
Thank you. 